Hi, welcome to the Pecos Wilderness. We're here testing the Big Agnes Belly Ache Mountain SL 15 degree bag. This is made with a new kind of down. The problem with down has always been that when it gets wet, it clumps, it doesn't insulate. This has made with what's called down tech. And so it's got a polymer impregnated down that is supposed to have it resist water and also it's supposed to dry faster when it does get wet. Uh, we did not, we had some condensation in the tent last night. So the outer shell did get wet, and <clears throat> it has a nice uh, mummy feature to it. Uh, it is a mummy bag. It has a nice draft collar. Uh, the zipper works well, easy in both directions. It only got to 45 degrees last night in our tent, so we didn't really test the 15 degree rating on it. But what I was really after testing on this bag was whether or not we could simulate a real world condition where you arrive in camp, you do your laundry, you put it up, and it never completely dries before it's time to go to bed. So we wanted to test and see if we could go to bed with wet clothes in this bag and still stay warm through the night. So in order to simulate that, I took a shirt and I got it really wet and washed it. Then I hung it out and for, after a couple of hours, I wrung it dry and it was still pretty damp. So I put this on and went to bed with it in this down bag, which is something you would never do with a regular down bag. And overnight, I stayed warm, toasty, the shirt dried, so it's dry in the morning. That's how we dry our clothes in synthetic bags. And I wanted to see if it would work with this new Downtech bag. And it did. I woke up in the middle of the night. It was still damp. I could feel that the bag was moist on the inside. It even felt like it had gone through to the back. Or maybe that was the condensation in the tent. But it worked like a champ. And uh, it kept me warm. And so I'm going to say that this bag will insulate you wet with wet clothes on. That's all from the Pecos.